Hello folks, and welcome to another episode of Army Man World at War, Land, Sea, and Air. As pretty much while we load here, uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, pretty much just let the game play itself out. <laughs> and basically it's simple command, follow the river to the thing. Uh, let's get some. Let's get some more. Let's get some more. Come on, come on, come on. Get some. Get some. Get some. Get some. Yeah, go, yeah. Come on. Get some. Get some. Get some. Uh, yeah, yeah. Come on. Want on destruction? Come on. Get some. Get some. Yeah. Come on, arrow. Quit standing there. Come on. Get some. Anything that's standing still is a trained a trained tan, and everything that's moving is a untrained tan. And there's a gray guy in the water for some reason. But anyway, we'll never mind that for now. But, uh, yeah, that's my att my attempt at doing a parody of the uh, Full Metal Jacket scene of the Thor Gunner. As you can see, that's what we're doing here, is we're being a, a Thor Gunner and a Huey. No other army man has this scene, so... <laughs> Enjoy it while it lasts. That's all I can say. Well, it looks like we we found some friendlies. And it looks like they're being pounded. I gotta look around. You're getting pounded hard. You got. Well, it looks like we got some friendlies. Even more friendlies coming in. Let's help our friendlies out here. Pick them up. Looks like we just give we give them some heli cover. He's not dropping off anything. Huh. Oh, looks like he's flying with us though. I guess he picked up them guys down there. Go ahead and shoot the bushes here. Anyway, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm probably going to put in Surfing Bird at this rate, too, <laughs> but <laughs> go ahead and enjoy it while you can. Like I said, this, this is a good parody for Full Metal Jacket, and I'm going to go ahead and use it all up. <laughs> These the details were nice enough to me that we can actually do this. Which, like I said, once once again, hint, hint, this would be a excellent way for a good first-person shooter. Mm -hmm. And there's car towers there, and it looks like the helicopter there descended, trying to be sneaky on us. We'll take him out. Anyway, there's river boats and all that. Now, if you were with me along my World at War, uh, the original one, uh, you've already seen sort of where they were planting landmines and we were shooting down helicopters off it. Well, now we get to shoot them. Isn't that a little, a little bit twisted? But yeah, they wanted to go full Vietnam feel here. Definitely jungle valleys and lagoons and passageways and all sorts of wish washies. All sorts of zaniness here. Looks like we're going to free some uh, green POWs. Oh, there's some guys up there on top. So it looks like this is going to be another one of them all scrolling quick missions. But at least it's fun. And like I said, uh, no other Army Man game, I think, as far as I know, actually has this sort of moment where you can actually shoot off the dang copter. I'm sorry, but that's just being honest. I, I don't remember any other army man having this sort of scene here, and it is fun. I love this scene. Wish there was more of them. It looks like we got to take out the guard towers. I said this does it kind of this is very neat for a type of sh uh, you know first person shooter MMO style thing 
or even as a co-op or something, you know, it's pretty neat. You know, people say nowadays, oh, graphics are lame, you know, graphics are lame, don't bother with it. Well, I don't know. This actually, like I said, this this looks like a lot of fun. I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind playing this game as an MMO. So, yeah. Uh, it looks like uh, we're dropping off our paras. I mean, our uh, troopers here. And it looks like there. Uh, looks like we're full cargo here. And there's a tan pilot who's with us. So uh, this will be the end of the LP. So see ya.